Stop using Google and Bing. I just found an AI search engine that's a hundred times better. Google's been around forever and they haven't really changed that much, right? It's riddled with ads. That's the same stupid articles on there. I mean, just ask yourself, if you were to create a perfect search engine for yourself, what would it look like? What features would it have? I've even been using TikTok as a search engine the last year or so because it's just a better experience that shows me more of what I wanna get out of my search. And so I saw somebody else post a video about you.com and it, it looked pretty awesome to be honest. So I wanted to dive into it. Honestly, it's my new favorite search engine. I've been using it almost every day now and I wanted to share with you why it's so cool. Maybe it helps you too. Firstly, I love that they respect your privacy. So they're not tracking your every search. They're not sending you custom ads based on your browsing history or sketchily something that you said while you were on your phone and now you're all of a sudden getting ads for that thing. Secondly, you can stop paying for some of those other generative AI tools because they have an AI content writer built into the platform, as well as a text to image generator as well that's really powerful and you can use both of these features for free. Now I'm gonna show you how to use both of those features a little later on in this video. Make sure you keep watching. But first I wanted to show you a side-by-side -side comparison of what a search looks like on you.com versus on google.com. So first let's just do a standard search for something like pickleball paddles. I'm putting together a, a pickleball fundraising tournament and I'm gonna need a paddle. And so we can see here, like basically this is how Google has always looked. We have a list of sponsored ads up here Then there's a bunch more, you guessed it. Sponsored ads. And it gives me some places to shop, but it doesn't really give me really good information here. It has the people also ask section, which is great, but it doesn't give me a, a whole lot of information. It, it just wants me to buy the paddle. This is just not really that great of an experience. Now, vice versa, if I do that search on you.com, it really incorporates AI and I can actually have a conversation with it as well. So it gives me a, a couple places that I can uh, pick up pickleball paddles if I want. It gives me information like popular pickleball paddles in 2023, but then I can actually ask it a follow-up question like which one is the best for a beginner? And so it's like having a conversation with a search engine. So it gives me an explanation of each of these pickleball paddles, for instance, and then of course where I can actually get that pickleball paddle. And you can even go deeper down this rabbit hole, like what else should I know? This is my first time playing pickleball. And this is honestly why I love AI, because it's just a much better experience. This is the information that I want to get out of this. I don't just want to buy a paddle then and there. I want more information, I want context, I want it specific to my use case. The other really cool thing about you is that you can customize it if you have your own account. So like if you sign up, which is free to sign up by the way, you can customize your search. And then if you have biases towards specific uh, news outlets or anything like that, you can filter around that. So you can say like, I don't want articles shown up from TechCrunch or I want them to be higher. For fact checking, I could say, I don't want Wikipedia articles to come up as a fact check for my question because anybody can provide information in Wikipedia. Even social media platforms, you can choose if you wanna see more results from whatever platforms. You can literally customize the search engine to your liking. The you write feature that they have on here as uh, as well is really incredible. So if you're paying like $50 a month for any of those writing tools out there, I would suggest trying this out at least because it's really powerful and it just is an all encompassing thing. So they have these built-in use cases here, email, paragraph, social media post, blog article. You can choose your tone of voice, of course. I love that they have the audience in here so you can write it to a specific audience. And so I can put that audience in here. I can tell it what the article is about and click right now. And it's gonna write that entire blog article for me in seconds. And then the AI image generator is incredibly cool too. So for instance, I can choose if I want it to be a higher quality image or if I just want it to be faster or anime. Nani? And so I can type something really specific like Mark Zuckerberg as Goku going Super Saiyan. The setting is in space. 
He has a golden aura around him. And pretty incredibly, it creates this photo of Goku in space with an aura going Super Saiyan, but with Mark Zuckerberg's face. Now, U.com is a free tool to use. It comes with 10 AI image generations, 10 AI writing, and of course, all of the traditional search engine features and customizations for your account. But honestly, if you wanna pay the $9.99 a month, it is a steal, because it comes with unlimited AI searches with GPT-4 built in, which if you think about it, chat GPT-4 costs 20 bucks a month anyway. This cuts that in half. It has unlimited AI image generation, unlimited AI content creation. And so I want you to ask yourself again, if you were to create your own perfect search engine, what would it look like? Let me know in the comments. And if you'd like to try you.com out, I have a link for you in the description. See you in the next video.